Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to go about changing your mouse settings on your Windows 10 computer. So this should be a pretty straightforward tutorial, guys, and without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So, all you have to do is open up the Start menu, type in Control Panel, best result, you come back with Control Panel listed right above App, so go ahead and left click on that. Select your view by and select large icons. Select mouse from this list. Now, this is basically all the mouse buttons and functions you're going to be able to play with here. So, first option up here at the top for the button configuration. If you want to switch your primary button, so if you want to make your left click or right click, you would switch it by selecting that option right there. Uh, double click speed, you can adjust that. So, if you notice that it's very slow to respond to double clicks, you can adjust that speed right there. And you also have the option for click lock, which enables you to highlight or drag without holding down the mouse. So to set briefly, press the mouse button, and then to release, click the mouse button again. So you can just hold and drag down without actually having to hold down the whole time, basically. And you can now also click on the pointers tab here, too, if you want to change the pointer size or make adjustments through there. If you want to do custom ones, you can do that as well if you want to browse for pointers. If you have some third-party pack you want to get from online, Pointer options, you can adjust the pointer speed, how quickly it moves or displays on your screen here, top option here. You also can hide the pointer when you're typing something on a Word document, perhaps. In the wheel tab, you can adjust the vertical and horizontal scrolling speed or how many lines will be displayed at a time. And then you also can adjust the hardware tab here, too, if you want to adjust the hardware of different mouses that have already been hooked up and recognized on your computer. If you need to remove anything or check out the properties, you can. So pretty straightforward process there, guys. And once you're done, you can just do apply and OK to save any changes, restart your computer, and that's about it. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.